gather around for the children's message. I'm so glad you're here with us today. All right, so you know what, I have a question for you. Do you guys know the song, This Little Light of Mine? Do you remember that from Sunday school or whatever? Sometimes we even sing it in church. So you know what, because I have a hard time singing, Pastor John's gonna help us and let's join in together and let's all sing together, okay? You ready? This little light of mine, oh. I'm gonna let it shine. This little, oh wait, wait, hold it, hold it, hold it. stop, 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 oh, Pastor Jean. What? Your light, it's not shining. Oh no, why is my light not shining? It's, it's turned on, why is my light not shining? Huh, well let's see. Uh-oh. Do I need to plug it in? Hmm, let's see what happens if I plug it in. Maybe I need a cord. I'll bring my cord over, and then we'll plug it in and see what... Now does it work? Yay! Are you ready? One, two, three. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Good job. Thank you, Pastor John, for helping us shine our light. All right, but what did we need? I needed that cord, didn't I? Oh well, all right, we'll see. I got something else to show you. Look at my branch. Is this cool or what? This is from our yard, isn't that neat? I can't wait to see all the maple leaves blossoming and blooming out on my tree. The red and the yellow and the orange leaves. I can't wait, can you? Looks good, no? It, it, by now it should be budding though, shouldn't it? Because it's spring. How come my tree isn't, my branch isn't budding? Where are my leaves? Uh-oh. There's not attached to the tree, is it? Is my branch not gonna have leaves? <sighs> Just like my light needed something to plug in, my, tr my branch needs something to attach to to help it grow, doesn't it? It needs the rest of the tree. Oh dear. Now what are we going to do? Maybe we better read our Bible story and see if it can give us a clue. Alright? Alright, let's see what the Bible tells us. Jesus wanted people to know more about his love for everyone. Jesus said, think of plants in a garden. I'm like a vine. The branches that are joined to the vine grow fruit. A branch can't grow fruit without being connected to the vine. Maybe that's my problem. The branch can't grow fruit unless it's connected to the vine. Hmm. All right. When you're joined with me in love, I help you live the way God wants you to live. Jesus continued, God is the gardener, watching over the vine and its branches, the gardener makes sure the plants have all they need to live and grow. We understand, the disciples said. It's important to love you and stay connected to you, Jesus. But what else is important? The most important thing, Jesus told his disciples, is to love each other like I love you. When you do, God will know and will give you everything you need. Oh, Jesus is the vine. Okay, so just like I needed electricity for my light to grow, and I needed a tree for my branch to grow, we need Jesus for us to grow and to give us life, right? So if we think about Jesus as the electricity, our light shines when we're connected with Jesus. And like the tree, Jesus is our tree and we're the branches. And because we're connected to Jesus, our branches, we can bear fruit. And when we bear fruit, we share God's love with others. So as our light shines and we bear fruit, because we're connected to God, we can share that with each other and share that with others who need that love. That's pretty cool, huh? 
Because if we're not connected to God, our light won't shine and our branches will be dead. The only thing this is good for is firewood, isn't it? Yeah. So without being connected to Jesus, our vine, we wither and we don't shine. But when we're connected, our lights shine and we can share God's love with others. So this week, think about that and you be the branches that are connected to Jesus, to the vine. Be filled with God's love and share that with others. Bear your fruit and shine your light knowing you're connected to Jesus. Can you do that? That will be so cool this week. And then let me know how you shared with others, how you shone your light this week, and how you bore fruit to others. Have a good week. Go shine your light and be connected to Jesus.